Mike, uh, uh, how many brands of trailers can you name in 10 seconds? Go. Uh, Aristocrat, Ken Skill, Yellowstone, uh, da, 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 da. oh, Ken, uh, Barth. Barth. Hey, we got a little bit of help going on sorry, over here. Sorry. <laughs> and a Hanson. Okay, a Hanson. not too bad, not too bad. Uh, best color for a trailer? Silver. We got a lot of help coming around off screen. <laughs> best place to go with the trailer? Here or Pismo Beach? Okay. Uh, How often do we go camping? Yeah. How often do you go camping? <laughs> we go go fairly often. We like to go to the vintage rallies and the trailers okay. and, and stuff. We only have the one trailer now. We used to have five, but we've pared down. <laughs> you used to have five trailers? Yeah. Well, once you get the bug, you, you yeah, get, you're get in trouble. Going, and then we got carried away, just like we did with the trailer and the yeah. car and I got other cars. So That's what happens. We got carried away. All right. Awesome. Lots of amazing cars here today. Incredible trailers. I think it's time for a lightning round. This is Dion. Are we ready for the lightning round? Yeah. Okay, best color for a trailer? Red. Because I have a fireball. <laughs> <laughs> of course you do. Best place to go on a trailer? Field center. As many trailers as you can in 10 seconds. Go. Sh Shasta, fireball, uh, low, uh, low liner, um, uh, I forget what comfort. You got me. This is Larry, and he's another trailer uh, aficionado. Yes. Uh, we, we need an official term for what everybody is. Trailer park trash? No. Uh, no. How many trailers can you mention in 10 seconds? Go. Oh, God. Shasta, Comfort, Fireball, uh, Ideal, mm -hmm. Airstrip. Uh, best muscle car that goes with the trailer? Muscle car? I, I'm into the hot rod trucks right now. Okay. C10s. <laughs> best hot rod truck, C10? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Lightning round. Uh, best muscle car for uh, to pull a trailer? Best muscle car, uh, Corvette. <laughs> oh, of course. <laughs> Best scooter to ride around at a uh, trailer event like this? Um, um, mini bike. Mini bike, yes. Yeah. Okay. Butter yellow. It's oh, butter, look at this. <laughs> yeah. That, you want to go up and just spread some on your pancakes? Yes. Look at all these guys, it's the cheering squad. Oh <laughs> my gosh. Break down, side of the road, left by my spouse, and he had to go home. Had to be towed. Had to be towed. <laughs> Couldn't remember the word. Yeah, getting all this hard. It's, it's, all, it's all this pressure when you have so many people watching. Where'd you guys come in from? Saugus, Santa Clarita. Okay, that's not too far. A couple hours. Yeah, but it's a little cooler here than it is in Santa Clarita. Uh, I froze last night. I'm roughing it. <laughs> I may or may have not have mentioned this. Tony Dow and his wife Lauren are on their way to this trailer park and there are special celebrity guests. They're about 45 minutes out, almost here, and until they get here, I'm just gonna chill. Okay, we're with, with uh, David Neal, the mastermind behind this trailer uh, fiasco. Yes, sir. Okay. That's what some people call it. This is the lightning round, you ready? All right. Okay, best, uh, best color for a trailer? Coral. Best car to pull a trailer? Uh, Nomad. Your best story with a trailer in only 10 seconds. Go. My best story with a trailer is I had two blowouts in one trip. Oh, yeah. nice. I like it. Yeah, uh, we call it retirement. <laughs> retirement, you get it? So this is the 8th annual Buellton Vintage Trailer Bash. I'm with 195 of my trailer buddies. This happens every year in September at the Flying Flags RV Park in Buellton, California. Each year uh, it gets more and more exposure and I would invite anybody who has an interest in vintage trailers in the 50s and 60s to come up uh, in September of any year from now until the future right. and come see these uh, beautiful trailers and the owners that uh, care for them. And sign-ups literally start today. Sign-ups start today. Okay, so by the time you see this, it's going to be a few days old, so get on it. Yeah.
can't get 10 feet without seeing a cool trailer. You know, I'm lucky if I make it that far, but uh, you have a very cool trailer back here. Tell me about it. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. It's a 1954 Algella. It's a 13 foot uh, length mm -hmm. and uh, we did a, a frame up restoration. 59? 54. 54. Okay. And we did a full on restoration uh, frame up. Wow. And and what what kind of shape was it in when you got it? It had about a three foot hole in the roof and it sat in Ashland, Oregon for about 30 years. What so do you, what you do could you think, swim in it. What do you think caused a three foot hole? Neglect. <laughs> just just left it and... Just neglect. It wasn't like an asteroid hit it or something? No. Yeah. No. No. We're not sure how, how it happened. but. And how, was, how long was the restoration? About a, about a year on okay. and off. Yeah. But, Because you have the one trailer, I mean the one motorhome. Thank you very much. That Tony loves the most. Oh, All right. Yeah, I was winner. You're gonna give it to me. Gonna winner, winner, chicken <laughs> dinner. <laughs> it is so cool. It is yeah, amazing. It. It's really. Cool. What kind of shape was this in when you got uh, it? This was a project one, and we do the LA Roadshow Show every year. And I was down there walking the swap meet, and I came across this, and I've always loved these. And I said, okay. He said it was for sale, and I said I buy it. You can drive it to Bakersfield. Uh, it's mine, and he drove it to Bakersfield, and it was about a four-year restoration, and wow. we did interior, exterior, running gear, and made it into a car, I mean, motorhome, I could drive anywhere, anytime. And wow. it's okay. always been our dream to have one, and we realized that dream. Yeah, fantastic, what an inspiration. Thank you. So. And how long have you had it? Uh, over 10 years. How long has it been 10 years, Betty, or? Gosh, maybe 10, 12 years. Ago. Eddie's over here. Yes, that's the other half. She's the brains behind the outfit. <laughs> yes, absolutely. <laughs> trailer park for the last couple of hours. Lots of people recognize Tony. Uh, Lauren's over here buying some things. It's Studebaker wagon over there. It's overwhelming the incredible trailers that are at this event, including this. Look at this, right there. GM Futureliner, right there. walking around with Tony and Lauren looking at all the trailers really cool then we went and crashed for a little bit because we walked about almost three miles and now we're gonna go get some dinner and there's a bunch of stuff that's happening tonight including uh, a Batman movie and the sundowner party not sure what we're gonna attend because there's a lot of stuff going on but one thing's for sure we're all hungry Come around, no. 
it's not over yet, just so you no, know. I, uh, the whole thing is a party. Um, the food is good. The food was so funky. Yeah. It was great. Lots of little um, barbecued weenies. <laughs> Lots of deviled eggs. <laughs> Lots of barbecued weenies and deviled eggs. We lost Tony somewhere. I know. I think the dog took Tony to the dog park. This place is, is a kick. Yeah, it's awesome. It's like, there's nothing like it. I don't think in the world. Yeah, and we're going to go to the really sundowner party even though the sun but is already down. Sundowner is a, a disease. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to talk about that and weenies in the same conversation. <laughs> 